Well, hello there, sexy people. Well, most sexy people, I mean, people these days aren't really attractive. I'm going to make a Christmas haul. Is that what they call it? Is that what those, like, beauty girl makeup people call it? I don't even know. Let's just call it a... Let me show you my awesome presents thing. And I'm very sorry for people who have less presents than me, but I did not really get anything last year. So, this year, I think I deserve a lot more. And you probably don't think so because I never made a video in a really long time, except for the one that I posted yesterday. Well, I should have posted it yesterday. Dingle hopper, 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 thing. I'm going to show you, I'm going to try to show you really quickly what I got for Christmas, but I got a lot, so that's not going to happen. Sorry. Okay, to start off, let me show you this freaking amazing Sharpies. There's 28 Sharpies in here, and I would spin it to make an awesome color wheel thing, but I can't catch for my life, and I just hit my boob. Ow, that really hurt. So, I love this. I will name them all. I love them so much. Yeah. Oh, and I got a lot of clothes, so I'm going to show a lot of clothes, but I'm not going to like, you know, be like, oh, I got these clothes. Like, I'm not like that. I'm not a girly girl. Ew, that's disgusting. Anyway, I got a bunch of socks. And for those people who know me in person, even, and don't know that I like fuzzy socks, you better friggin' learn that I like fuzzy socks, okay? Because I love fuzzy socks. Look how many fuzzy socks I got. I love fuzzy socks. And I lose a lot of my socks. That's why I got socks for Christmas, though. Anyway. Um, I also got this 216-piece puzzle of Big Ben. Yes, mwah, love you, okay? Um, that's gonna keep me really occupied and really quiet, which I'm never quiet, so that will be... Very interesting. Um, I also got this really cute, like, jacket sweater thing. It'll keep me really warm in the winter time. So I'm actually kind of happy that I got that. I also got, um, this perfume from Love and Beauty. And it actually smells really good. Anything that does not smell like my mother's perfume, it smells good to me. Because I just, she sprays so much in the morning. It's a really, um, sweet smelling and stuff. And, like, the bottle, it's like all cheetah. <laughs> And stuff like that. I'm just really actually happy what I got for Christmas this year, you know. So I also got these um zebra print tweezers. I think they're awesome too. Yeah. And my little baby sisters, I still call her my baby because she'll always be my baby. But she's six years old and she used her money and she got me the, a couple things from Claire's. She got me this um UK inspired um charm bracelet and it has a little phone booth. I dropped it, that's nice. It has a phone booth a bow, um, a little Union Jack, a taxi, yep, and, oh, I didn't notice this before, a little Big Ben right there, so I think that's adorable, and she also got me this matching necklace with the same things on it, so she knows what I like, I'm sure my mom picked it out too, oh, and I also got these, um, Doctor Who socks, they're amazing, these little TARDIS, this says, um, the Cyberman Delete, um, oh, K9, this is a K9, they're so cute, I love K9, um, these are Daleks, oh, and other Doctor Who socks with the logos on them. Yes, <laughs> I know what I'm going to do to close the video. Sorry, I just thought about that in my mind. I also got this, um, like, really awesome weird yellow chartreuse kind of colored cami to put under this, um, really cute, um, shirt. And it has, like, a like, see-through in the back, so I think it's cute and I could wear with the cami underneath it. Those are like my two favorite colors if you haven't noticed the colors of my room, but, yeah. And I also got these pajamas, this is a pajama set, and it looks like this. I'm still working my new camera, so it's kind of hard to function. Um, oh, speaking of pajamas, I also got these really awesome Doctor Who pajama pants, what what, and they have fezzes and bow ties, which are cool by the way. If you do not know they're cool, I suggest you become a Whovian because it's one of the best things you can do with your life. Just saying. Actually, I'm not saying. I'm demanding. You better freaking watch Doctor Who. It's either you never seen Doctor Who, or you love it. There's, you know, there's no other options. You can't not like Doctor Who. Unless you don't know you like Doctor Who. Speaking of Doctor Who, I just got this shirt. Um, it's the Exploding Tardis shirt. And I also have a matching poster for my room. And I have a matching bookmark to go with my TARDIS journal, which also has little TARDISes and circular um, Gallifreyan writing on every page. So I think that is absolutely adorable. Um, what else did I get? 
Oh, what did I not show? Oh, I got this um little cute makeup bag and it has like little mascaras in it. This is um I really don't need mascara actually because I have extremely long eyelashes and when I wear mascara they touch my cheeks or my glasses. But um it comes with jet black, extreme black, and black, and it's supposed to extend your um, eyelashes. Uh, where is it from? Um, it's from Pure Minerals. And it's got this mascara too. Um, it's accentuating lashes from Drama. And I also got this Avon little eyeshadow palette thing, which I think is cute too. With those four colors. In it. Yep. I got that. And I really, I actually really like Avon products, especially their um, eyeshadow, because it's kind of creamy too, just depending on what you get. So I really like the way that comes out on your eyes. Um, what else? Oof, it's a huge bag. Oh, um, I also got, where's my, oh, I put it over here. I got the Star Wars Anakin Skywalker Episode 3 action figure, and oh my god, it matches all my other action figures that are over there that I'm not going to go get because I'm lazy. But, um, I'm really upset though because it kind of came out of its thing and I really wanted to keep it and not unbox it, but, you know, it's kind of too late now, so now I could, you know, play with it. I also got this little sock thingy, a jigger, and it has little crunch and snow caps and a bunch of Smarties and double bubbles. I will get it. I will get it and show you. See? Yep. I got those. What else did I get? Oh, this is actually one of my favorite things that I got for Christmas. It's from Five Below, but still, the quality is just absolutely amazing. I'm trying to peel off the tag, even though it was five bucks, because it's from you know, Five Below. Um, yeah. Um, this is a little notebook, and it says music on it. And if you don't know, I'm in five choirs, and I play 32 instruments. And I am very particular, and I love music to death. And my mother got me this, actually. It has um, five bar staves, staffs, staffs, whatever, in here. And I could write my own music, and there's, I don't know how many pages, but I'd say there's about 200 pages in here. And I'm very happy about this. So, it's a really nice notebook. My mom also got me a one of my favorite movies, actually, next to Family Opera Tron and Star Wars and Harry Potter. Um, she got me The Outsiders by Etsy Hinton on DVD, and I'm going to watch it ten times. Another one of my favorite movies is The Breakfast Club, which I've always wanted on DVD, too. Um, I got more clothes. Another thing I got from Kohl's were these really cute sweaters. I'm not really going to take them out of the box because they just look the same as any other order on sweater. But I got a striped sweater, and I got a gray one, which is cute, too. Um, oh, I also got this um, duct tape with the Union Jack all over it. Yeah, I think that's cute. Um, I also got these necklaces with um, changeable charms that I could put on them. So I think that's adorable. I love the box, actually. They're both so cute. Um, what else did I get? I got more! Oh, I got bras and stuff like that. Because, you know, the, I'm, I'm honestly going to show you because they're... I love this one. Look how cute this bra. Oh my god. Okay. And I got this color, too. Yep. And what else did I get? Oh, I got this shirt! I'm, okay, I'm not obsessed with the video, but I sing it all the time. I got a What Does the Fox Say shirt. Yes, I don't know if you could read that. You're probably not going to care. But it says, but there's one sound that no one knows. What does the fox say? I think that's an adorable shirt. And I also got these kind of like scarlet orange colored jeans. I think you could throw more orange in the video screen. But I love skinny jeans so much. Um, what else did I get? I also got some razors for Christmas and some Pure Silk shaving cream. And what else? I got more! I know I got more! Somewhere around here! Oh my goodness! Ah. What, what kind of noise is that? Oh! I got this little safe thing because my mother knows that I like to hide things all the time. So I have this little like safe. Oh, I should not do that. It's actually bad. Um, what else is safe? Oh, I also got this bracelet, and it says Dream on it. It's from Kohl's, and I will wear that all the time. It's so cute. So, I love it, and I love, like, the little casing in the box. Another thing, these are my last two things that I actually got for Christmas, I think. Yeah, I think they're my last two. Um, this is probably one of the most favorite things that I've ever gotten. Um, it's 
very, very, very expensive, actually. It's the limited edition Doctor Who 50th Anniversary Monopoly. And I am extremely excited that I got this. You know, I'm gonna, I'm only gonna play with Who because other people, normal people, don't deserve to play it. But, uh, alright, I'm just really happy I got this. And my last thing that I got, which is my absolute favorite thing that I got in the whole entire world, is this Doctor Who blanket. Oh my goodness, I love it so much. It matches my Doctor Who ornament. And if you can't see, it has all the doctors, ranging from William Hartnell, P Patrick Troughton, John Pertwee, um, Tom Baker, where, where, is, where are you, Peter Davison, Colin Baker, Sylvester McCoy, Paul McGann, David Tennant, oh no, Christopher Eccleston, David Tennant, and Matt Smith. Sorry, they're not in order, so it's kind of hard. But I love this blanket so much. <laughs> Sorry. Um, I, it's just so comfortable, you know? I just... I'm very happy with this Doctor Who blanket, but, but yeah, um, I also wanted to talk a little bit about, you can't see my head, <laughs> I actually wanted to talk a little bit about tonight and what's happening at 8, 9 Central, um, on BBC America for 5 to channel 189. Tonight, um, the 11th Doctor, Matt Smith, is regenerating to the 12th Doctor, Peter Capaldi. Um... David Tennant is my doctor, and he'll always be in both my hearts. And when I found out Matt Smith, you know, came, I was really upset, you know, because David was my favorite. But I think I should appreciate all the doctors as one, because literally it's one person. But Matt Smith, the way he connected with his companions, it's just extraordinary, too. Also, I was crying at this yesterday in Christmas Eve. But... Honestly, is Matt Smith as a doctor, I'm gonna miss him so much. And you know what? I'm very proud of Peter Capaldi because I know Stephen Moffat would never choose a person who's not fit to be the doctor. And I think Peter Capaldi's gonna do an amazing job. Who the hell cares that he's older? You know, William Hartnell was also um, the same age as Peter Capaldi is right now when William Hartnell started being Doctor Who. And ever since 1963, you know, history was made. So I think Peter Claudi is going to do an amazing job. I will cry my eyes out when Matt leaves and he starts glowing gold. But I also wanted to take this time to say that I love you, Matt Smith. And I love the 11th Doctor. Not as much as I love the 10th Doctor. But I think all the Whovians are going to raise up their hands and surrender. And say, I love Matt Smith. Because everyone knows that. He was an amazing doctor. All jokes aside, I'm really excited for tonight. And yeah, I'm only closing the video like this, even though it's not the 11th Doctors, but the 10th Doctor still will always be my favorite. Thank you for watching. Love you guys.